let's talk about pastel papers. I'm not going to go in depth into all the different papers. I've got videos out there where I really compare lots of different papers against each other and I give you my opinion. With these videos, the whole aim of it is to keep it really simple. I don't want people to be overwhelmed when they start in. I just want them to make a start in pastels and I want the techniques to work for them. So my favorite paper of all, if I showed you that first of all, is called Pastel Matte. And that's by a company called Clayfontaine. Now Pastel Matte, if you buy it in books like this, when you open it, you've got a little sleeve, a protective area, and then the papers in the box come in various different colors. The surface is not a sandpaper type surface. If you listen to it, it's a, a textured surface, but it's not a rough, rough texture. It's actually um, fibers on there. It holds the pastel very, very well. And that means I can layer extremely well on it. If I bring the meerkat back from video one and the eye, you can see how I built up layers on top of each other. This is all pastel matte paper. So that's the paper I recommend. The colors that's most usable are mid-tone colors. Brown, such as this. Dark gray is another one. Sienna, that'd be another good one. Those are the type of colors I would look at purchasing. You can also purchase these in individual sheets. In the books, they come in, um, I say different colors in those. So those are more of the sandy kind of colors. This one has more like wine, blue, sand as well. You can also buy pastel mat in these small um, packets also with the paper this is a nice set so it's got sienna brown anthracite could be nice sometimes but as i said those ones that i suggested are the ones i use most commonly i like drawing and painting on a mid-tone surface so that's why i go with that but if you can't buy pastel mat it's not all over. I've got other videos that I'll show and link to that shows other alternatives, such as pastel card that um, can be used and you can get fantastic um, results on those as well. Pastel mat just happens to be my preferred surface. But what I will say is this, for it to work, the techniques I show, the layering techniques I show, You've got to have a surface that will take layers. Normal paper won't do it. Standard pastel papers, such as um, it's spelled ingress, but I think it's pronounced on gray. Those type of papers, they will not layer like pastel mat and like the sanded papers layer. So I urge you to look for the other videos. I say a link below to the other videos I've done on paper. The paper is not something for you to cut costs on or to shortchange yourself on or to get the wrong type. If, it, if you use the wrong type of paper, then you will not get the layering ability. You're gonna be disappointed. Those papers I found work much better for abstract or very loose styles instead. So my suggestion, number one, if you can get pastel mat, get that. If not, take a look at the other videos. There are other alternatives. Just wanted to quickly mention my Patreon channel for those looking for even more in-depth art instruction. It's packed full of pastel videos, oil videos as well, and those videos are being added to new ones every single month. I have videos for the complete beginner that have never done pastels or oils before with just limited supplies. And I take you from the very first blocking in all the way through to the final detailed drawings and paintings. I've also got some really unusual subjects as well. And in all of my videos, I always take you through all the details. You see everything I do, how I create my work. 
but it's not just for beginners it's also for novices and I also show the best artwork that I've ever done as well and this particular elephant video spans six hours so you know you're going to see tons and tons of details tips and techniques and as mentioned I've got lots of oil videos on there too so there really is something for everybody and you get access to hundreds of hours worth of videos for just four dollars now over a thousand members strong, hope to see you there soon.